Hello dear biotechnicians and we are back with another very unique vacancy and today it is Inter-University Accelerator Centre Scientist Recruitment with up to Rs 1.77 lakh per month salary. Okay, so Inter-University Accelerator Centre, I don't think most of us have heard for it but anyways they are recruiting for the vacancies of scientists so let's take a look at what this is about. Before we take a look at all of the details, let's see what this Inter-University Accelerator Center is. So this was set up by the University Grants Commission as the first Inter-University Center called Nuclear Science Center after due approval of the Planning Commission and the Prime Minister in October 1984. Okay, its construction started in December and was completed on time in 1990. The basic objective of this Inter-University Accelerator Center is to provide front-ranking accelerator-based research facilities to create possibilities for internationally competitive research within the university system. The center has been playing a very special role of a research institute within the university system. Okay. A couple of its research areas include nuclear physics, material science, radiation biology, accelerator, mass spectrometry, atomic physics and health physics etc. So as of now IUAC is inviting applications from qualified Indian nationals for the po following positions on direct recruitment basis. So scientist C is the name of the post. Group A and there are 14 vacancies where it's broken down, uh, broken down into unreserved 6 vacancies, OBC 3 etc. Age limit is 26 years and mode of selection is written test and interview. So make a note, initial appointment will be as scientist trainee and on successful completion of 1 year training period, the trainee will be absorbed in level 10 of pay matrix as scientist C. During training, the stipend will be paid. Okay, so like I said, this is a scientist C vacancy, but initial appointment will be as a trainee and you have to complete one year of training period and then you'll be absorbed in this vacancy. So the pay level is level 10 and here is where the scale comes in, rupees 56,100 to up to rupees 1,77,500. Okay, so this is the scale of pay. Now moving on to the qualifications, so you should have MSc in Physics, Applied Physics, Life Sciences or Biotechnology for Radiation Biology. If you recall, I said one of their research areas is Radiation Biology. So in that case, you should have a Life Sciences or Biotechnology MSc degree with consistently good academic records. That is from class 10 onwards with at least 60% from a recognized university or institute. Candidates who are slated to complete their MSc course in the academic year 2021-2022 are also eligible to apply provided the final degree is available at the time of the interview. Okay, so for radiation biology, MSc, life sciences or biotechnology with consistently good academic records is what is needed. Now there's an application fee which is to be paid through online mode. So since you're applying for scientist C vacancy, rupees 1000, SCST and PWD candidates are exempted from payment of the application fees. So how do you apply for these vacancies? It's an online application pro process and the link to apply online is provided on this page and this page is linked in the description box. So let's take a look at a couple of the relevant documents that you need to upload in the application portal. So beginning with educational certificates in chronological order, that is your 10th, your 12th, your diploma, UG degree, PG degree, all the years marks list of the minimum educational qualification prescribed for the post applied. Experience, if any, should be mentioned in chronological order, that is to begin with the latest to first employment, then coming your photograph and signature, self-attested copy of category certificate, no objection certificate from current employer if employed, and one of the following valid photo identities, that is Aadhaar, Passport, PAN card, voter, etc. Candidate must produce the same original valid photo ID proof during the examination for verification process. Okay, so a hard copy of the application will not be considered. So if you want to know more about the notification, if you want to read it in detail on your own, then the link for that is also given on this page. Like I mentioned, the application portal is also linked here. And this link is given in the description box. Okay, leave a like and let us know in the comments if these kind of videos helped you. 
and I encourage you to check out the stores page at Biotechnica because there are very interesting stuff for you right over there ranging from certification courses to internships we even have a bio entrepreneurship course so for all your budding entrepreneurs over there you can enroll for that course you'll be taught by our in-house experts on how you can get started in your entrepreneurship journey we also have an internship regarding molecular biology techniques which will be launched soon so that's very interesting do enroll for it and apart from that we have bioinformatics and chemi informatics even so stores page is what you need to check out also download the biotechnica app from the app store because these jobs get posted there sooner since it gets updated faster over there make sure you follow us on all of our social media like this channel as well and then Follow us on Telegram because that is where we can communicate with you the fastest. So all the best and we'll see you in our next one. Thank you.